Guys, welcome back to Chomp Chomp Chewy. Today we're gonna to make one of my favorite things, and that is guacamole. So, check it out. All right, avocados are one of my favorite things in the world. And guacamole, um, a lot of people have a tendency to overcomplicate it, and I think that's where they go wrong. Of course, that's my opinion, and it really doesn't matter because it's cooking. Do whatever you want. So, you know, I mean, that's our philosophy here. Pop that little seed out and put it right in. Look, how easy is this? I'm not dicing it up, I'm not cutting it, I'm not doing anything like that. The reason being is this is all going to get smashed up anyway. So, I'm going to do that real quick. Okay, so we have uh, about four medium sized avocados in our bowl here. And then, like I said, we want to keep this really simple. All right? So, um, you'll find people putting like taco seasoning and things like that in their guacamole. No. I want the avocado to be the star. That's why I don't really put in tomatoes. I don't put in onions, you know. And if that's your thing, you know, we're cooking, right? Do it. But for me, it's just not what I'm really into. Uh, check this out. I like to roll my lime a little bit. Just like that. Just breaks it down just a bit for me. And then it makes it much easier to not cut, apparently. <laughs> Ah, okay. I'm gonna take this lime and squeeze it. Of course, I just want the juice. If a little, uh, if a little of the meat gets in there, that's fine too. I don't really care. So I'm gonna go right there at about probably about a quarter, I would say, of a lime. And the reason I say that is because for me, guacamole, I want to taste it as I go, and so that I can develop the flavors um, kind of how I want to do it. Right? Uh, cilantro, fresh out of the garden, or fresh from the grocery, whatever you want to do. Matters not. I'm just going to give that a rough chop and it's going right in. And then that's basically about it. Right. We're going to taste it. We're going to add a little salt and then all of a sudden we're going to have a delicious snack. Watch fast, fast, fast. This takes no time at all. I honestly think the longest that uh, the, the thing that took the most time is probably walking out to the garden to get the cilantro. So, Perfect. Now we're just going to take those. We're going to smash it up a little bit. And you can go as chunky as you want. You can go as, you know, creamy as you want. I know some people have a tendency to blend it a little bit. I like mine a little chunkier. And it's for me. It's not for anyone else. So I'm just going to give it a rough, rough little uh, smash here. And a fourth use is just fine. Let's try that. All right. Again, it's for me. So I'm going to taste it. Mm. I don't know if there's a more perfect food uh, as the avocado. I love it. It's amazing. Try this at home, right? Check it out. Bang. Nothing to it. Fast, easy. So try it. Like us. Uh, follow us. Subscribe. We'd love to hear from you if you uh, give it a go. And uh, send us some pictures. All right. This is Vernon from Chomp Chomp Chewy signing off, and I'm going to grab some chips and go to town on this. All right, I'm out.